Pyraxis and welcome to Yubes, the ultimate epic battle simulator. Now today, we're gonna try and find out something really cool. We're gonna actually try the zombie here. His name is Olaf. Don't mistake him for the Olaf from the Frozen movie. Just let that one go for a second there. Cause we're gonna this guy. He's hailed from the north of the coldest mountains. He's not like any simple zombie. He's not like any other zombie you know of. But the thing is, this zombie, he has a deep and dark secret. You see, Olaf, he doesn't have any friends. He tried to get friends in the olden days, but no one wanted to be his friend. And now he's gonna try and use all his rage and his loneliness to take over some new chickens to be his friends. All he wants to do is be friends with the chickens. So today we're gonna try and see if Olaf can befriend this whole army right here. You see this army of chickens? It's the best friend you can have. And if you don't like your friend, you can just deep fry them and have a nice dinner on Sunday morning. Yeehaw. So we're gonna try this battle right here, and this is gonna be amazing. You see, I've been trying a lot of these things. I've been experimenting. I've been trying a lot of these things. Look at him! <laughs> Look at him go! Olaf going! Oh, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look at this. Now he has a lot of friends. So many friends the Olafs have. I don't have that many friends. I probably have like like two friends in the whole entire world. And it's like my girlfriend and my mommy. Olaf has so many friends. He's so happy now. Olaf, how do you feel? Wait, that's not you, Olaf. Olaf, how do you feel about your new friends? What do you mean? You're not Olaf? Where is Olaf? I can't find Olaf. Olaf, friend? Where are you? Olaf, Olaf, I can't find Olaf. Oh, screw you guys. I don't like you. <laughs> but um, so but um, and they got nuked. Now they're even more dangerous. Now they're like Godzilla zombies. Oh, great movie idea. <laughs> no one's gonna steal that idea from me. I'm gonna make that idea. Make the millions of dollars. Befriend the celebrities. And then make even more million dollars. Ha! Ah, zombie Godzilla. Part two, the zombie apocalypse, the zo zombzilla apocalypse. This is a really good idea. Don't steal that idea. That's my idea. That's my. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna try something else now. I don't even know what we're gonna try because this game has so many possibilities. This game is like the Forrest Gump of games of simulatorness. You know, life is like an ultimate epic battle simulator you ain't you never know what you're gonna get so what we're gonna try now is we're gonna try a little bit what i want to call the animal kingdom and what that is is you have three animals different animals like the chickens the tortoise and the penguins you see we got the penguins right here the penguins we're gonna do five thousand of each that seems a bit fair doesn't it and we're gonna see who is the ultimate animal kingdom who can survive the mostest and the hostest? Because we're gonna try here. Uh, what is? Why do they look so much different on? So we're gonna put them in the trifecta triangle of the holy courageness of the Link goodness and the Zelda, and we're gonna put them around here in the battlefield. Uh, it would be cool to put them around here actually, but first we're gonna try out the prowess on the battlefield. So they're attacking, set to attack. So let's go. We got the tortoise chicken and the penguins. Who's the most tastiest? And who's gonna win this epic battle? The losers are tomorrow's dinner. Or tomorrow's dinner. Or tomorrow's dinner. All right, now we're out in the field here. We have the chickens over here. We've got chickens all over the place. All of the Donald Ducks and the Daffy Ducks and the Scrooge McDucks. Who's Mr. Donald? Who's Mr. Scrooge? 
I don't know. Oh, in the right here in the left side, left side, top corner, we got the tortoises. They're going to all over the... And then we're going to have some... Much all over... The all right, so these guys, the tortoises, look at them. They like that grass, and they're going to eat that grass, and that grass has a lot of, like, steroids and speed. You see, the, the tortoise always beats the hare. And my hair is looking mighty fine today. So I don't know if the tortoises are going to beat that hair. And where is the other animals? The penguins? Penguins? Where are you? Where are the penguins? Did I put them up here? I don't even know where I put those penguins. I don't even see those penguins. Do you guys see the penguins? Do we want to start the... Oh, there they are. We're going to go over to the penguins. It's not that cold actually. So I don't know if the penguins... We're having a difficult time here. See, they blended in with the environment, but these guys, they are ready for some showdowns and some good times. They've been training all summer to get to this fight here to prove themselves as the rightful owners of the Masters of the Animal Kingdom. So let's go. All right, we're starting the battle now. It's going to look amazing from the top view here. We have the best seats in the stadium right here because we are the gods. So we have the chickens. It seems like they're going towards the penguins. And then we had the tortoises, which are gonna, they're gonna take forever. <laughs> Maybe I should have put the speed up on the tortoises. I didn't know they're gonna be this slow. I'm sorry, Johnny Billy. I didn't know the tortoises were gonna be this slow. Maybe next time I'm gonna tell Johnny Lewis to put the speed on the tortoises to the max. Put them to tortoise to hare. And then we're gonna see who cares. Alright, so we're going to go over to the chickens and the penguins. And that's going to be an exciting battle. They already started without us. Oh, here we go. The chickens and the penguins. The penguins are mighty fierce <laughs> opponents for the chickens. They like chicken. They've been they've been good having the good times. They learn how to do the deep fryings. So they've been plucking them chickens and they've been taking them all over the place and they've been having the good times all up in the Antarctica. Is that where they have penguins? In the Antarcticas. What if you had an, an, an aunt named Artica? Antarctica. <laughs> that would be funny. Okay, so we're going to speed up this match a little bit. <laughs> Look at this. This is amazing. I don't know who's winning. But we're going to see how the tortoises are doing. Yeah, the tortoises, they don't even know where they're going. But at least they're trying to get somewhere in life. And that's not, that's a lot of you can do in life. Life is all about trying to get somewhere from point A to point B. And then when you get to point B, you go to point C. You never stop looking forward until you get to the end of the alphabet. And then you start over again. Because life is a circle of life. And the turtles and the tortoises... They know how they know what's up. They know what is up and they uh, know exactly where to go um, ex Except that they don't I don't even know where they're going Where is this? Oh, they're fighting on one edge here. I didn't even know so the penguins They got to the tortoises, but I think the tortoises have some mighty good shell defense against the penguins. I mean look at this stuff See he's, he's hacking and knacking and mapping and the blood is going everywhere. But whose blood is it? Is it the tortoises or the penguins? We do not know. But what we do know is that the, the, the penguins, they're going to die. <laughs> they're going to die from the tortoises. I think the tortoises are the mightiest kingdoms. I mean, the mightiest animals of the animal kingdom. I mean, lions, screw the lions. Lions don't know anything. They think life is a circle. Life is not a circle. It's a straight line with some divergence. Some divergence, you get some obstacles and then you jump over those obstacles, you overcome the obstacles and you become a better man or a better animal. Animals, you know, dogs are humans too. So let's speed this up a bit and we're gonna see what's happening over on the other side here. Are they still fighting? Where are they? I cannot find. Penguins? Chickens? What? The chickens look like there are less. Penguins are superior. To the kitchens. The kitchens and the chickens. You see, you put the chickens in the kitchens. Then you put them on some toast. You put them on some nice pasta. You can even put it on salad. If you like the green stuff. 
It can be good. You can put some lemon on that salad and the chicken. But listen, ma. Check on. All right, I think the penguins are gonna win on this side. So we're gonna go over to the other side here and see who's gonna win between the tortoises. Look at them. Look at them. Look at the tortoises. Look at the tortoises. You got Billy, Johnny, Johnny Johnson, Johnny, Johnny Bilson, Johnny Bilson, Bilson, Johnny, 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 Johnny Gilson, and Gilson, Bonnie, and Gilson, Jilly, and Jack, and and, and, and Bozo, and, and, and Tozo, and, and Jillo, and, and Gallo, and Bello, and Tommy, and Tom Tom, and Tim Tom, and Tim, 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 Timmy, Tim Tom, and Tim, Jimmy, Jim, Jam, Jim, 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 Timmy, and Timmy Tom, and the other rest of the family. So the, I think they're winning actually. The uh, tortoises are the best. Uh, no questions asked about that. Uh, I think that was great. I think we have the winners. The tortoises are victorious as the kings of the animal kingdom. But can they withstand the nukes? And then there was silence. We could only hear the wind in our ears and follow it for next time for some more animal kingdom okay so we're gonna try for the next match we're gonna try both of the heroes and they're gonna be the chunk norris he's had too much chunky nuts too much oreo ice creams he loves the desserts he loves the triple chocolate muffins mmm so great why are you outsold and then we have the golden knight he has the golden nuggets. We're gonna put them in the ocean here, actually. We're gonna have some undersea water battles. Uh, actually, no, I have a good idea. We're gonna put we're gonna put one guy here. We're gonna have the golden knights. No, that's Chunk Norris. Chunk Norris is gonna be outside. He's gonna be the attacker by the downstairs stairs here. And then we're gonna have the golden knights defending the fortress. It is gonna be nice. I hope there's an opening here. We will find out in a moment. Let's start this battle. Are you guys ready? Let me know in the comments below. Type ready if you are ready and we shall go. I will wait here. I will wait for you to type the ready in the comments. And for you to like the video. And for you to subscribe. And for you to share this with your grand Annie. Alright, we're out in the battlefield here. It's kind of laggy. I don't know. Is it the water? Too much good effects. Oh, it's loading. Down, 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 down. Well, sometimes you just gotta go and load the goddamn units, okay? Please. 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 Can you load the units? God darn it. What is this? Is this bugged out or something? All right, I don't think this game is working right now. So uh, we're gonna try some more next time. So please leave some suggestions and then some likes, and then some more comments, and then I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.